Oh, this is my Kyber Pass special. For milling. Rough milling. It works pretty darn good, too. Okay, so what did I do today? Okay. I made a dovetail the other day. And today I cut out a slot. It's hard to see it, isn't it? Weird. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Lighting. Oh, yeah. There's the brass piece. I mill that section off today and it's a dovetail and it's a nice fit uh, let's see so it moves back and forth very nice nice and it's just perfect actually sits inside here okay that's where I milled it on the Kyber Cat, Cyber Pass milling machine. To hold it on this side, it doesn't have a dovetail here, but a flat piece. Right, so what I did do is cut this piece, which will go here. Doesn't look good, but I don't know. It's hard to do anything with it filming. Anyway, and that'll be bolted. Just apply pressure down here. There's the two holes, and I thread it. Or I made it like that, so that's it. Got a bit of a step going up that you can see it right here the reason I did that for adjustment well tomorrow I might do that or work on the radios and uh, let's see so here I'm cutting more brass up For this piece here, I want to raise it up a quarter of an inch, so I found a quarter inch brass plate. And stick it up here. So the head stock will mount on two of those, right? And then um, the head stock will be held in place by another piece. What am I doing? You know what I mean? My iPad holder. <laughs> what the hell am I doing? I can't see what I'm doing. No. And stick out a bit so, like that. And it sticks out on the side a little bit where it can attach um, a hinge and a motor. So, this is your Kyber Pass special. Yeah, that's perfect. I like that. And that bolt hole there will go into the other plate down here. And I can move it around different angles. The whole compound. Oh, that's kind of fun doing it. I mean, lordy. Yeah, that's nice and tight. It's just perfect. Push up my hand, you know. Like so. Where the hell am I? Oh, here I am. And tighten it. I'm going to adjust the tension somewhere here. Yeah, that's going to work fine. That's just my quick ways instead of using a drill by hand and make one turn this down on the top and make a small ball or other crazy junk. But I enjoy doing this stuff. I learn a lot from it. And here's um. 
still sit on the very bottom. Just to hold the headstock tight, very tight. And these will be bolted in too. Put it under clamp, bolt. Put it all together and away you're off to the races. So I haven't decided on what motor yet. What's there? What's going on here? Huh? Small one. Rags and things here. Hmm. Well, it's been around. Sort of a, I got a mini laser for Christ's sake. Why am I doing this? Because I want to. I like doing stuff all the time. Just, you know, you learn a lot from doing stuff. Keeps you busy. Keeps you out of trouble. Well, I found this piece. I wonder if I was good on that. Radio. Hmm. Check that over too. Where all the plugs are, the uh, connectors and stuff like that. So. Then I'll set the whole thing on a chunk of good wood. Put handles on it so I can carry it around. <laughs> ah, oh well. Insanity has its moments, doesn't it? Uh huh. So six minutes already. Well, I think I'll go get ready to go somewhere. Hmm. So. Okay. Well, like I got inspired to make this silly thing. Then we gotta get organized on that area. We're gonna organize the high voltage and proper wiring procedures for all that. Once that stupid lifter gets out of here, which is by the back door there. It lifts you up about 10, 12. 15 feet. Well, it doesn't work. It keeps goofing up. So, I think Nancy's going to get rid of it. Then all the high voltage stuff goes in that area and I keep moving stuff around. Something like that, huh? Oh, I'm always busy creating stuff, so. This stuff fired up, which all work. All repaired and everything. It takes time, but what else are you gonna do? And then I got your radio the transmitter. I tell that off while I'm here. Why not? in the other room and I got mint condition single channel unit which I think I showed you already right? so here's the one you see what are you reading here again radio transfer so and then a small scope RTGY monitoring system. Here's the single channel thing. <laughs> I thought I put something up here, did I? No. I'm putting one up here. And the modulator should go down here, I think. Pretty heavy. So, floor crane time. <laughs> Fun stuff. Anyway, I should get going. Okay, cheerio.